Suppose that you drive 24,000 miles per year and gas averages $4 per gallon. What will you save in an annual fuel expenses by owning a hybrid car averaging 50 miles per gallon rather than an SUV or a sport utility vehicle averaging 12 miles per gallon? Now, if you deposit your monthly fuel savings at the end of each month into an annuity that pays 7.3% compounded monthly, how much will you have saved at the end of six years? To compute for the fuel expenses, we will use the following formula, and then we will compare the results between the two cars. For the annual fuel expense, you'll just have to compute for the annual miles driven divided by the miles per gallon and then the price per gallon. We're given here that the average price per gallon is four and then the number of miles driven per year is 24,000. So for hybrid car, it's 24,000 divided by 50 times $4 is equal to 1,920. For an SUV, for a 24,000 miles per year divided by 12, 12 miles per gallon times 4 is equal to 8,000. So therefore, by owning the hybrid rather than SUV, you would save 8,000 minus 1,920 or 6,080 in an annual fuel expenses. It's more expensive to own an SUV car than a hybrid car. Now to calculate for the annuity or the amount that you will have in your savings when you try to save the amount of money that you saved in the fuel expenses to an annuity account. We will use the following formula here. Annuity, you're paying 507 at the end of the month. So this 507 here is computed from the total yearly savings of 6,080 per year divided by 12, and that is 507. The annuity account pays you a 7.3% interest. So 7.3% in decimal is 0 0.073. The investment is done for a period of six years on a monthly basis. So monthly N is equal to 12. So plugging it into this formula here and using a calculator, you get a total of 45,634. This 45,634 is the amount that you have in the account after six years. This illustrates here how driving a car that consumes less gas can yield significant savings for your future.